so it's Wednesday, uh, February 22nd, 2017, and I'm actually at work right now. I came in a couple hours early so that I could uh, ink up that comic strip from Monday night, the uh, one I did in class. I really liked how it turned out. It's been raining a lot here in California lately, uh, and my son Emmett, he's just over a year old now, and since he was born, it's we've been in a drought, and he hasn't ever seen rain before. And so last week when it was raining, I took him outside and let him splash in puddles. And it was it was pretty a magical moment. <laughs> Before I took him inside, we were I was holding him and we were looking up at the stairs, or looking up at the sky. Both had our tongues out like ah, catching raindrops. And he was giggling and laughing. And it was a really special moment. So I decided for my moment for this comics class that I would I would draw that. Let me show you what I got so far. It's kind of rough. We only had 30 minutes to pencil it out, but I really like this stompy pose right here. <laughs> and that's us. All right, I'm gonna see how quickly I can do this before work starts. I'm gonna do it really quick. <laughs> As you can see, I changed a few things. I centered this panel a little bit more. And same with this, I shrunk them down. I cleaned up the face a little bit. I wanted to emphasize this panel a little bit more, so I took my profile out, because it felt like it was forced in there. Feels good to be drawing comics again. <laughs> Even if it's just like a quick short one. My intention is to do more meaningful stories, at least more meaningful to me. That was kind of why I got out of doing freelance comics was it just seemed like I was doing other people's stuff and yeah, I, uh, I like my instructor, Jim. He's he's a good guy. We've kind of become friends over the last few months and uh, he's a really patient teacher, <laughs> which is what I need. I'm very, uh, I'm kind of a slow learner. I hate to admit it, but it takes me a while to get things. I'm mostly self-taught in everything that I do. Even when I take a class, I have to go home and sort of teach myself what the teacher just explained to me. And I've always been like that. I, I always struggled in, especially in junior high and high school. You kind of need to be challenged. You need outside influences to, to push you to grow, out, uh, push you out of your comfort zone. And um, I've been struggling so much the last few months that I knew I needed something. So, so far, this is good. And uh, I look forward to next week. I've got to present my short story. Uh, I'm re-presenting it. I'm also rewriting it so it's a little more succinct. I think that's it for today. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching. Keep smiling.